Welcome to the Cube After Dark. I'm Shelly Kramer with the Cube Research Team, and we are here at La Mer Restaurant in San Francisco as part of RSA event. And I am so excited. I'm here today with Dan Vigdor, who is the founder of a company called Thrive Thrive DX. And what they are doing as it relates to cybersecurity training is really, really exciting. Dan? Great to have you. Hi, Shelley. Great to be here. Thanks for having me in Absolutely. this uh, New York Stock Exchange Open Policy event. Absolutely. Well, I'm so glad our paths crossed. So we were talking a little bit about, I know that you do cybersecurity training. We're going to talk about that. But part of what you do that I'm so fascinated by is you train young people at universities to have cybersecurity training and certifications. Well, and well we train people from uh, all backgrounds, all sorts of life from different communities. We train them and then place them in jobs. Adult learners from the ages of 18 to 50, people looking for their next career. And as you know, there is a lack of 750,000 cybersecurity roles just in the United States alone. It's a right. matter of national security. It's really, it's really a problem. Oh, I'm We well solve aware, it yeah. not just training people and giving them jobs, not changing their lives, but also protecting the way we live. Protecting government, enterprise, it's, it's, a real, it's a real problem, it's a real threat we're facing. Well, and I think part of the, your value proposition at Thrive DX is really important because I have a couple of kids of my own that I'm getting ready to send to college. And so I kind of pay attention to conversations that parents are having. And, and I'm seeing a lot of parents, of students who are graduating with cybersecurity degrees, having trouble getting jobs. And so I think that it's one, if we very much need people with skills, but getting jobs is, is part of the equation that's really challenging. So I like the part of your value prop in that not only do we train you, but we help place you in a job. And I think that really is incredibly valuable. It's exactly what we do. It's a, it's a 10 months program, it's about 400 hours part time so you can work. We train you and we also train you on LinkedIn resume and, and have mock interviews and then we give you interviews in real positions and places. We have about over 90% placement rate in the first six months after you graduate. So it's different than uh, undergrad or graduate university which is a, a way to get a degree. This you get a certificate but you actually get a chance to get a workforce, to get, to get into the cybersecurity workforce. Got it. Okay. So talk with me a little bit about the, how do people find you? Well, we train with about 25 top tier in, in community colleges across America. Colleges and universities from University of Chicago, Broward Community College, University of Miami, University of Chicago. And so they have, we, it's a turkey project where the University of Chicago Cybersecurity Boot Camp. So it's uh, overseen by the university. Actually, the University of Chicago Cybersecurity Bootcamp just got approved for veterans to use their GI Bill benefits. It's the first university certificate non-credit program to actually get approved by the GI Bill in Illinois to be able to use your benefits to pay for it. Oh, so that's... it's a great way for veterans that are looking to what to do next yeah. to come in, train cybersecurity. We help them find jobs, and the GI Bill and their benefits help them pay for it. Oh, well that's awesome. Yeah. That's awesome. So tell me about your first day at the show. What are your impressions? Have you had a good day? Well, the show, I think, you know, everybody's cyber, 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 but everybody's talking about two main things. One is AI, 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 and how it's changing everything we do. And the other is cybersecurity workforce. People are really, really worried about the talent and the talent pipeline to fill the very jobs that are needed. Yeah. Yeah, no, and I think part of the problem here is that, you know, you need highly skilled workers in one part of this equation, and then you've got this other group of talent that really doesn't have a lot of experience, and so you, there's certain limits on what you can do with that. So it's people with just a little bit more training, a little bit more knowledge, that are really able to step into some of these roles and make a difference. And that seems to be what you're solving for. Exactly. Our, our people that come to our boot camps are highly motivated. So they learn very quickly. They really want to excel and to get those jobs. So even after our training, even though they're entry level and we can shape them by that specific company needs, they continue to learn afterwards. So we continue to give them upskilling as they go along in their job. And they're so motivated that they start learning by themselves. 
So the company that hire them really love our graduates. So this is a 10 month program that they do with Thrive DX? Well, it's, it's a 10 month program that they do with the university, okay. but we administer the program, we train the program, we have the student success, we have the career services, we do everything, it's our instructors, all of them working in the industry, adjunct professors of that university. The university has complete oversight, so they get a university certificate and we help them find a job. So it's really a, I'd say, turnkey solution both for the university and for the learner. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. So what are you, what's next? Well, we already put in, since the last six months, AI tools into our cybersecurity bootcamp. Okay. So you're actually learning how to be a cybersecurity stock analyst with using AI tools. And we also have labs that are real life scenarios, practical skills, like an uh, internet site with a vulnerability that you have to solve for. It. And we, through using AI and machine learning, as you go through the labs, we can ascertain and assess you and see what kind of cyber job you're best fitted for. And then we create a personalized adaptive learning type of, of, uh, of, of curriculum for you that's specifically made for you or customizable to the company you want to go work for. So if you want to go work for CrowdStrike, we'd be able to give you content of CrowdStrike for you to learn so you're ready for that specific job. Oh, wow. Well, that's very exciting. So how many universities are you partnered with now? Globally, we're at about over 36 universities and community colleges across the world in six different continents. And they have our boot camp, we're also co-creating master's program, and our lab environment they use for, for all their students across. And our lab environment will be able to, through AI, also generate immediate training labs for any exploit or vulnerability that comes along. So we'll be able to, the moment there's a vulnerability, be able to have a training lab for it to supply everybody, supply companies, enterprise, governments. Very exciting, very exciting. Well, I'm so glad that you made time for me today. Dan Vigdor with Thrive DX joined us on theCUBE today at RSA. And thank you so much for hanging out with us. And just know that this is a place where you come for all the RSA news. Shelly Kramer, we'll see you again.